will be using a custom script. Comet script which can be downloaded here. So if you go to this website here, you can download the script. So to install the script, you're going to download and extract zip file into a folder. All those files in the unzip folder will look like this. You have to copy them using Ctrl and C. Once you copy, go to your Maya script folder. Script folder is in C documents, Maya 2016, then scripts. Four different versions will be different, like 2018 or 2020. Just paste the script in here. Put all the mel files directly in this folder. Then go to your Maya. Now to run the script. You have to type in a command, open the script editor here. Open a new mel tab. In there, type in source comet menu.mel. Remember it's case sensitive. It will also help you first run a rehash command. To run the rehash, select the text, then press play. Now just run the next line of code and it will launch the comet tool. Again, select the text and press play. As you can see, now we have this menu showing up. You probably don't want to run this every time you start Maya. Move this script with middle drag into your custom shelf. You can customize the button by right clicking and editing it. In here you can type an icon name. You can also type in tooltips. We made a button which opens the menu once we click it. You can also make the script auto start when Maya is being launched. Go back to your Maya scripts folder. Remember the settings folder is in C, Documents, Maya, Maya version, Scripts. Then look for the file user setup.mel or make one if it's not there. In the file you have to enter your command like this. It's content sensitive. Once you start your Maya the script menu should be there. Look here. With that we are ready to move on to the first part of the tutorial, 